Summer is just around the corner, everybody, and I'm so excited to show you my go-to dessert for the hot summer days. Hey, everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Clarice. For this delicious, refreshing shaved ice dessert, you're going to need three cups of milk. You can choose whatever milk you want. You're also going to need three tablespoons of corn syrup. Now the corn syrup is a key ingredient because it's going to give that soft and fluffy texture that we're looking for in this shaved ice dessert. Next up, go ahead and whisk that up and then we're gonna put a lid on this container and we're just gonna put that in the freezer for about a couple hours. For some gorgeous presentation, we're gonna take a small watermelon. Of course, you can use the bigger ones, probably gonna save you more money, but we're gonna use this as our bowl as well. We're gonna take a melon baller, and this is basically what's going to give that beautiful shape that we need just to give it a little bit of a pretty aesthetic to our dessert. So take as much as you want from the top and then at the bottom, you can leave that because you're gonna go ahead and dig into that anyways later on. If you guys didn't know, this shaved ice dessert is also called Bingsu, which is a really popular Korean dessert and they sell them here for about 20 bucks. So it's definitely worth the DIY at home. After our mixture has been frozen, we are gonna take that out of the freezer and then I'm just gonna take this cheese grater and we are going to grate one half of this mixture down. Now, as you can see, it's giving us this beautiful fluffy texture that we are totally looking for. I tried one recipe before without the corn syrup and then I used this blender and this is what it came out to be like. It's kind of like this really slushy, very tough in the mouth type of feel. And this is what we're looking for. We're looking for the light and fluffy feel. So definitely make sure that you use the corn syrup. So you can put as much or as little of the shaved ice mixture that you want on top. And then all you have to do is decorate this with whatever toppings that you want. And we're basically finished. How amazing do these look? I mean, not only do they taste good, but they also look beautiful. Hopefully you enjoyed this DIY. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of this, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.